And we're back for Belator 78, which is taking place at a place called Nutter Center. So there we are. That's in Ohio, by the way. Uh, they're televised bouts. We've got the welterweight semi-final, uh, a middleweight feature fight, and a featherweight feature fight as well. So the semi-finals, we've got uh, Mikhail Tsarev fighting Lyman Good. Now Mikhail's got the better record, um, but I'm still going to go for Lyman Good. Uh, the other semi-final is uh, Andrei Koreshkov and Marius Zar Zaramoskis. Now, in fact, Andre has a um, perfect record of 11. But it won't be perfect after this meeting uh, because he's facing somebody 19 and 6 and uh, Marius is very good. So I imagine that the final will between, be between Lyman Good and Marius eventually and I don't know who I will choose <laughs> out of that one. So there we are. Their middleweight feature fight, Dominique Steele and Brian Rogers. Uh, I think I'll go for Brian Rogers on that one. And their featherweight uh, fight, Daniel Strauss and Alvin Robinson. Uh, Daniel Strauss has got a much, much better record, so I'm going to go for him there. Now, their preliminary bouts. We've got a bantamweight feature fight between Jake Norrissey and Justin McNally. Um, apparently... Uh, Justin's got a 0-0 zero, uh, zero, zero record and Jake a uh, uh, perfect record of 12. Uh, that may well be because they haven't updated it yet or uh, I don't know. Uh, either that or it's squash match uh, in the extreme. Uh, lightweight feature fight, Rocky Edwards and Rob Hanna, both with one uh, apiece. No idea. Um, a middleweight feature fight, they've got Mikkel Parlo with a perfect record of eight, fighting Jared Combs at eight and two. Don't know there either. They are much better though at um, matching up these fighters uh, on records, certainly. Um, and we've got a middleweight feature fight, Billy Horn and Trey Houston, I don't know. Uh, a woman's feature fight, we've got Zoila Gurgle. I um, wonder if that's any uh, relation to George or not, I don't know. 11 and 1 is her record, and she's very fighting Casey Noland, whose record at the moment is 0 and 0. So, again, I don't know if that's true or if that's just not been updated yet or not, I don't know. Um, I don't know. I, 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 I just don't know. I don't, don't have anything to do with women's MMA, it has to be said. Uh, middleweight feature fight, Sean Asher with a perfect record of two, and Jason Butcher with a perfect record of four. And I'm going for Jason Butcher on that one. And that is uh, predictions in brief for this week. And uh, it might be predictions in brief uh, for a while now, if there are no more uh, Belator events in the next couple of weeks, which I don't think they are. So there we are.